Okay, so it is Monday morning about uh, 10 a.m. And once I record this video, I'll post and open the week's folder. So this is week five. Um, over the next couple of days, I'll work on grading the midterm and memo two. I'll be honest, I'm going to be a fairly generous with uh, memo two uh, because I didn't really give you a paradigm to write from like I did with memo one where you had to write out of the human resources relations perspective. So because of that on my part, I think the directions were a little bit too vague on memo two. Um, I think I'll probably grade relatively lightly on that one. Uh, and then, of course, I have the midterms to grade. Everything else is caught up. And uh, this week, you have two chapters, as usual, and uh, one discussion board and one written assignment. And um, while they are uh, not easy, I think the written assignment is the case study. And the discussion board is a three-part assignment that asks you to reflect on some things personally, personal, uh, a personal survey regarding conflict styles, um, your reflection on past um, decision-making processes that you have gone through on an individual level. It should be an interesting dialogue uh, between you and your classmates. And so anyways, you'll see that in the discussion board. But the significant thing that's due this week that I've been sort of hinting at for the last couple of weeks is that this is the week that the final project outline and description and annotated bibliography are due. These have been clearly articulated in the syllabus since day one, so I'm sure that um, many of you have already begun, at least I hope so. And um, you, you know, you know this is coming. So instead of it making it due Sunday midnight, which is typically when the week's work is due, I did tack on a couple of extra days for you to work on it. Uh, and so it's due a week from this coming Wednesday. So right now, Monday, um, you have about nine days to do it. Um, and so I'm asking for three parts. I'm asking for a uh, an outline of your paper. Uh, you know, a two-page outline of what you're going to cover in this five to seven paper, which is due later. A description of what you will put in your eight to ten um, PowerPoint slide presentation, eight to ten slides, and um, a uh, annotated bibliography of at least five sources that you will incorporate into your paper. So um, ultimately, I think that you should be able to do this in about five pages. Uh, so two page for the outline, uh, one page for the description of the PowerPoint, and two page for the annotated bibliography. And doing this well should set you up very easily in order to complete the actual paper and to complete the actual PowerPoint presentation. But at this point, I don't want the paper. I don't want the PowerPoint. I simply want an outline of the paper, a draft description of the PowerPoint, and of course the annotated bibliography that you will include in the paper. Uh, I hope that's clear. Uh, for this, you can combine it all into one five-page document and then attach it. I know a lot of times I stress my desire to simply have you type in the text box, and that's true certainly for most written assignments. But for something like this, it's going to be a little bit bigger. It's better if you simply attach a Word document. Okay, so I think that's it for the week. Um, I will uh, be certainly around as always, and uh, feel free to email me or post in the dinner, uh, general questions discussion board um, as you have need. Okay, so have a great week. God bless.